Oh, let's see on our, on our list. Okay. Now, if I could have uh, Adam and Ashley and Beckham come forward. And Bentley can go with you too, if you would like. You want to come up here, Bentley, as well? All right. Matthew chapter 19, verses uh, 13 through 15 says, Then there uh, were brought unto him little children, that he should uh, put his hands on them and pray. And the disciples rebuked them, but Jesus said, Suffer the little children, and forbid them not to come, uh, forbid them not to come unto me. For of, for of such is the kingdom of heaven. And he laid his hands on them and departed thence. As we uh, begin to, uh, you know, as... As we begin to, you know, uh, you know, this dedication, you know, unto the Lord, we know that the family is a divine institution. It's ordained of God from the beginning of time. Children are a heritage and a blessing from the Lord. As we commit them to Him, uh, as the parents commit them, and as the church, as we undertake this blessing and being able to bring them up in this way, that as the parents care for and protect and train them, for his glory, it is meant that all parents recognize this obligation and the responsibility to God in this manner. And the parents of, of, uh, of Beckham likewise recognize the sacredness of their, uh, their charge and now bring, bring back to the Lord the treasure which he has entrusted them with. In so doing, they recognize and hereby publicly acknowledge their responsibility for the nurture and admonition of, their, of Beckham in the, uh, in the ways of righteousness and godliness. And so this morning, with Ashley being a teacher, and as parents are to mold their children in the image of the Lord, we thought it appropriate for this dedication to present this family as we go through the presentation to offer them Plato. Because as you're supposed to mold them and actually being a teacher as well. And so Adam, you get the red Play-Doh, all right? He does. I wanted to present you with that red Play-Doh. The red is a symbol of the bloodline. As fathers, uh, we are responsible for the spiritual direction of our home. We are the priest of our home. And I also have a, a children's Bible for you as well. While... Uh, while we must provide you know, for our children financially, we also cannot uh, take our money or worldly goods to heaven with us. However, we can train these. Uh, we could train our children up in the way of the Lord and the way that they should go. We can make sure that these precious lives are in heaven with us. To Ashley, I present to you the yellow Play-Doh. There you go. We just knew. As a symbol, of, and the reason why for yellow is because that is a symbol of a mother's love. There is something special about a mother's tender hand and loving prayers that the, uh, this child is able to turn uh, to you for comfort and love when they will turn to no one else in the world. Live your life for Jesus, and these children will have such a great example of how to do the same. And to Beckham, you get the white Play-Doh. It goes along with his white suit. So that means he can play with it and not have to worry about it getting that dirty, right? <laughs> it is, uh, white represents pure, uh, being pure and spotless. My prayer uh, is that, uh, they would, uh, that he would remain pure and spotless before the Lord. I also would like, uh, you know, as well, as I have given Adam, you know, that Bible, that is his Bible. It is uh, sturdy and colorful so that his eyes will be drawn to God's word, hopefully, creating a lifelong love for the Word of God. And as I you know, ask you this question, you know, uh, respond, uh, respond with, uh, uh, we do. So in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses, do you solemnly undertake to bring up your child in the fear and the admonition of the Lord? Do you promise, to, uh, promise early to seek to lead uh, him to believe on the Lord Jesus Christ as Savior and Lord. Do you promise as far as in you lies, uh, uh, lies to set before him example of a godly life? We do. Yes. 
is he uh, okay to be, uh, you know, taken? Because you said sometimes he throws fits. So if he's going to do that, <laughs> if he. Not make any promises, eh? yeah. Oh, also, just so you know, this uh, suit I believe was uh, Adams, wasn't it? It was. He looks snazzy. I can't wear a white suit. I get that thing all dirty. <laughs> so with that, let's let's pray. Uh, uh, let's pray um, as I uh, pray over him. In the name of, uh, of Jesus Christ, we dedicate uh, Beckham uh, Lee to God and to uh, his service, Lord, that you would use him mightily and greatly uh, for your kingdom, Lord, that you would use him to reach others, and Lord, that he would um, honor his father and his mother, Lord, in the, in the best way, uh, and Lord, we ask these things in Jesus' name, amen. You're not sure about me, are you? He is checking me out like no other. <laughs> And so, and see, he's, he's like, you have a beard, but you're not dead. I'll tell you that right now. All right. So church, here's your charge. Church, are you willing to take uh, on the responsibility to love, care, and support uh, these parents as they work uh, to pass on their faith uh, to their child, promising to, lo- uh, to love them, equip them, pray for, uh, pray for and be uh, with them, I'm sorry, pray for and, and with them, supporting by example and involvement uh, in, their, uh, in the life of Beckham as they work uh, toward that end. If you, uh, if you agree to, uh, to that, please stand and say, we will. And as much as uh, you have promised before uh, God and uh, this, uh, this people to dedicate, your, uh, to dedicate Beckham to God, and yourselves uh, to the task of, of raising him uh, for the Lord, I charge you to address yourselves faithfully to uh, this sacred obligation with wisdom, patience, devotion, and to uh, this end. May the blessing of God rest upon you. Amen. And there's the day that he... Oh, I forgot to sign, I forgot to sign that one too. <laughs> I'm telling you. There you go. I'm telling you, you got everything else ready except for that. All right. And let's all, uh, as we uh, as we have uh, as we have uh, stood, let us sort of reach our hand forth as we pray together for uh, for the Hodel family. Heavenly Father, we lift up uh, Adam, Ashley, Bentley, and Beckham. Lord, we pray that they uh, that Adam and Ashley would be able to uh, bring them up in, into the uh, the nurture and admonition of the Lord. Lord, that you would give them wisdom every single day. Lord, we ask that same thing for both Bentley and Beckham, that you would give them wisdom at a very young age. And so, Lord, we, we, we pray these things, Lord, and we ask, Lord, that where their uh, wisdom ends, Lord, may yours be there and may it increase. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thank you. And uh, isn't it a great and glorious thing when when those uh, will, uh, will dedicate their children back, realizing that God gave them that child in the first place. And they say, you know what, Lord? Uh, you know, Beckham's not ours. He's yours in the first place. And we just want to you know, be a part of you know, raising him and those things.